recommend flying my Simon X8 quadcopter with the GoPro directly flat mounted onto the base. You're doing great, except for the vibration of the motor is causing vibrational aberration, also known as the jello effect, on the video. To remedy this, I'm going to install a gear vest anti vibration mount. First, I'll lay out the vibration mount for spacing, making sure not to interfere with the on off switch. Then I'll trace out the mount. Then I'll sand the area. I'll also sand the back of the base plate. Now that sanding is complete, it's time to crack open the super glue. Make sure to cover all the contact areas. Then place the mount onto the base of the quadcopter. Now apply extra glue around the edges of the mount to make sure it is attached. Making sure to stay away from the on off switch to not impede its function. First you're going to drill a quarter inch hole in the base plate. Next, pass the quarter inch bolt through the base plate to thread it. If the bolt head is too long to fit between the plates, we need to shorten it using a grinding wheel. Now it's time to assemble the top plate. Insert the ground off bolt into the washer, through the top plate, then into the GoPro mount. Then use a wrench to tighten it all up. If you're having issues inserting the rubber links between the plates, you can use a loop of fishing line to make the process easier. Insert the fishing line through the hole in the plate, then around the rubber link. Then pull on the fishing line to pop the rubber link through the plate. Like so. Cut off a 4 inch section of fishing line and insert it to the bottom of the rubber link. I'll then tie off the string using a surgeon's knot. Then trim off the ends of the fishing line. To give the mount a cleaner look, you can rotate the piece of fishing line around so the knot is hidden inside the rubber link. Now that all the rubber links have been secured, I'll attach a security mount to the side of the quadcopter. This will ensure that the anti-vibration mount ever fails. The GoPro will stay firmly attached to the quadcopter. Now that the GoPro is securely attached to the quadcopter, all that's left to do is go for a flight test. The mount is adjustable 170 degrees vertically and 360 degrees horizontally. Full build description and plan will be found on Instructable at the link below. To watch more drone footage, click on the video on the bottom. Husky Formula Racing Ice Racing this winter. If you see me flying an actual airplane, click on the video above. Make sure to like and subscribe. Feel free to click the big red button.